All right, Rankin family, welcome back to another beautiful property tour. Today, I'm excited to bring to you Grand Endeavors Homes. Now, this one is in Georgetown, Texas. You are absolutely going to love this beautiful property. Completely custom. You're really going to see that inside of here. Now, before you enter the property, this is what they really call a nice little courtyard area. Absolutely stunning. You are going to notice that from the interior to the exterior, it's absolutely immaculate. Now, as you can see, this is in the community where we have over one acres as far as the lots are concerned. Now, if it's something where you wanna go ahead and build, you can certainly do so. They are taking applications uh, to get you in the door and get you a custom built property. Now, we do have the natural stone. As you can see from the exterior, we have the natural stone plus the stucco going into our covered front porch. The one thing I really want you folks to pay attention to is the amount of glass panes inside of here. The windows, the abundance of natural light, but the view is absolutely stunning. There are lots that have access to look over that hill. I love it. So look at our glass pane double doors right here. Absolutely stunning. The natural stone continues again. And let's go ahead and get you inside of the grand foyer. Now, this is absolutely stunning. As you can tell, we have the tall ceilings on top with the beautiful chandelier. Now, look at the open concept inside of here. Everyone loves the concept, not to mention going straight ahead. You have this nice long hallway, but let's go ahead and start inside of our great room. Now, those are what you call clear story windows on top. You have the beautiful tray ceilings with the lip with LED lighting inside. Now, the one thing I really love about this particular model is the fact that we have floor to ceiling fireplace with the beautiful natural stone as far as the exterior uh, of the fireplace itself. Now, look at these sliders where you can easily open these up, have a nice view of your backyard. And I know we're getting ahead of ourselves, but look at our infinity pool. Absolutely fantastic. Now we do have our wine cellar really for decoration standpoint, or if you are a wine drinker, like I always say, go ahead and get you some bottles. Look like you can fit over a hundred plus bottles inside of there. Now this is gonna be our dining room. You have it right in the middle. So you have the great room, dining room, kitchen combination, which really keeps the family in place. That way you can go ahead and have the family in one place at one time without anyone feeling excluded. Now look at this beautiful marble. I absolutely love our oversized island. Look at this. And the one thing I really want you to pay attention to is the fact that you can be doing dishes overlooking your beautiful backyard and that view. Can't get much better than that. Look at this. Absolutely stunning. You're probably gonna do the dishes more often than you would imagine just because of the simple fact that you have that view. Now I absolutely love our cabinetry, we have these this nice wooden cabinetry, we have our beautiful wooden floors, again, oversized uh, stove top, our stove as well, the monogram, look at this. If you notice, our beautiful range hood. Right above this, look how sleek this looks, extremely elegant, modern, which a lot of folks love. Now, I know you've been wondering what's inside of here. Of course, it wouldn't be complete without this sleek refrigerator. Absolutely stunning, oversized refrigerator itself. Not to mention you do have the built-in cabinetry on top as far as our stack cabinets are concerned. Now this is gonna be our working pantry. Look at this, full size. We have LED on top, built-in storage, built-in drawers, and our countertops extends back here. Love our backsplash. We have the same material as far as the backsplash is concerned inside of the pantry as well as in the kitchen. Look at that. Can you imagine having this view? You have your family inside of here. Everybody's being entertained, loving it. Now we're not gonna miss any square inch of this property. I'll make sure we show you the backyard. So stay tuned for that, but let's continue along. Let's go 
to our next room. Now, this is going to be called the Jessa. This is what the model is um, called. You have your vaulted ceilings on top. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. So we have the exposed beams, beautiful chandelier. It's an LED chandelier. And look at the room inside of here. Now, like I said, there can easily be some customizations to the plan. Base square footage on here is usually about 3654. This is over 4,000 square feet, this model home. So the good thing is you can add, subtract to it, really just depends. But look at this right here, folks. Absolutely stunning. This is not even, don't even think you think this is, might be the primary. It certainly is not. It's one of the secondary bedrooms. But look at our tall ceilings with our exposed painted beam. We have shiplap on top. Look at that. Can you really get much better than that? So you have your king size bed with two oversized nightstands. We have our slide in uh, wooden door as well. Wow. Absolutely love it. Now, like I said, this is Grand Endeavor. Can I mean, have you seen anything as good as this so far? I'd love to hear your thoughts. I mean, that view just gives it a 10 out of 10, really. So we have our mosaic tiles. Now, this is a, um, a zero threshold shower, which I absolutely love. We have our shower bench in here. Again, floating cabinetry. Let me slow it down for you folks. Now, as far as our handles are concerned, we do have our brass hardware, our brass lighting fixtures, as well as our mirror frames. That's very unique. I love it. Love our sliding door. Of course, you do have the toilet where you can go ahead and close that off as well. Now, before we exit this bedroom, let's go ahead and make sure we look inside of our closet. Full size walk in closet that extends back here. Man, loving this. So right now, drop in the comments. Let me know what are you giving it? What do you like so far? What do you dislike? I mean, is there much to dislike? I don't know. We'll find out though. <laughs> we have our built-ins right here. Love this for from a decoration standpoint. And if you also notice, you even have access to go ahead and get to your backyard without having to open up the sliding doors, which I love. So opening this up, we do have a full storage closet inside of our game room. Go ahead and store some things in there. I like how they store that Christmas tree. Before you know it, Christmas will be here pretty soon. All right, so we have another bedroom. I love that they covered up this carpet. Don't want to get it dirty at all, but look at the space that you have in here. We have a tall baseboards, nice accent wall. Again, you could fit two uh, twin beds inside here comfortably with a nightstand and a nice little bench. Now this one's gonna have a full-size bathroom that's attached to it, but we have a full-size walk-in closet, again, that extends a little bit slightly. We have this nice plush carpeting, again, loving this. All right, so we got a mirror frame, we got our nice window, again. Now we do have this like sage green with our black hardware. I'd love to hear your thoughts on that. Do we like that or do we like the, um, the white cabinetry. Now here, this is gonna be a shower tub combo, but you do have a glass door. Go ahead and eliminate some of that, um, you know, splash or any spillage whatsoever. I think that's one of the first times we've seen that in an actual model house, as far as the glass. Usually, of course, you know, you put your shower curtain in there or something similar of that nature. Right here, we have a full size closet, storage closet. And then right adjacent to that, we're going to have our next bedroom. So this is to give you a better reference. Queen size bed, two oversized nightstands. Stunning. And look at our lighting on top. Very unique, very sleek. How we always say, very minimalist, which a lot of folks love. Wow. Tall baseboards extends in here. We have this wallpaper. Again, this is going to have a full size shower as well. So very similar. I'd love to hear your thoughts as far as this accent wall right here. We've seen more of that teal blue some of the times, but this is more of that pinkish color. I need to know these colors a little better. There's so many names for these colors, but again, full-size walk-in closet. So loving the space, 
right now. I'm loving the way things are set up inside of here. Really just depends. I mean, some folks may not need this amount of space, but goodness gracious. I mean, it's something where you might be able to grow into just depending on, uh, you know, what phase of life you're in, quite frankly. So the good thing is you do have this nice little powder bath right here. Go ahead and let the guests utilize this one without having to go to the other bedrooms or anything like that. And then you have this nice wallpaper again. Like I said, this is a full model home, really just to showcase their products, showcase what they possibly can do. So if it's something where you want to customize, like I initially said, you can certainly do so. Really just depends. But look at that. Can you really even get much better than that? Look at our glass panes, our glass front door, even just looking at the foyer itself, if you can imagine that. I love the fact that you can see through the front door to the backyard, and that way you can see anybody that's, you know, the guests in the backyard or any family, seeing them enjoying themselves. Now, right here we have a nice coffee bar area that you can utilize, or you can use this as maybe a chef's kitchen, if that's something where you wanna do. A lot of times people just go ahead and have their you know dishes back here in case they just wanna keep it clean inside of the kitchen, especially like I mentioned, if you do have guests in the house, you really wanna keep it presentable for the most part, uh, especially during Thanksgiving dinner and things like that. But look at this beautiful primary bedroom. Look at our ceiling, absolutely stunning. Now, have you seen a chandelier as beautiful as this. I love to hear your thoughts. Now we have a full fireplace inside of here. We have a gas fireplace. Look at the windows. You can open those up, let the fresh breeze pop in. Wow. Infinity pool, look at that. Can you, oh man, 10 out of 10 must recommend. But look at the, the room inside of here. Look at this, king size bed, two nightstands, of course, you have the fireplace, you have your nice sitting area. Look at this. Even going into your ensuite, you have access to your own private backyard patio. Look at our soaking tub. Can you get much better than that? I don't think so, quite frankly. Well, you have your own designated vanity area with our oversized mirror, his and her sink, floating cabinetry again. And then you even have another access point to your backyard. Let's take a look. Let's take a quick peek back here. Look at this. Enjoying your morning coffee out here, overlooking this beautiful scenery. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Let's let's get back in there before I get ahead of myself again. Absolutely stunning. Nice oversized soaking tub. Again, going this way, this is gonna be our full shower. Look at this. Oh my goodness, zero threshold with our shower bench. We have our marble inside of this one. Oh my goodness, can you imagine just taking a shower right here, walking out, popping in your soaking tub? Wow. Okay, so like I said, this is his and her sink. Let me go ahead and open up some of this cabinetry for you so that way you can see what we're working with. Soft closing cabinetry, loving it. Of course, you have your own designated uh, area for your toilet, and then look at our full-size walk-in closet. Wow, so you have your island right here in the middle, built-in storage space. You have little pockets for additional storage, built-in shoe racks, built-in, man, there's drawers everywhere. Plenty of space for his and her wardrobe. And I love the fact that we have the connection to the utility room. We'll go ahead and go through there, but I don't want to get ahead of ourselves. Let's real quick, and I'll do a pan, so that way I'll make sure you see the entire storage space inside of the primary closet. Of course, you have that access over the air. And again, like I said, this is the bigger of the model. They added some rooms to this particular model. so. Like I said, reach out so that way we can find out your situation and get you taken care of. But look at our little sitting area out here. You have access to the backyard. And look at that. We still have that whole section of the house. <laughs> of course, there's a sales office over there that would turn into a uh, garage, but it is the sales office right now. 
But real quick, folks, if you are a returning viewer, welcome back. I appreciate the continued support. And if this is your first time to the channel, my name is Marcus Rankin. I am a Texas realtor. I get calls, texts, and emails every single week from folks looking to make a move. So if you're in that bucket now or in the future, you can reach out to the information below so we can find out how we can help you book a call and to dive into your situation. But look at the extension all the way back here. I make sure that we'll go ahead and see every square inch of the place of the entire model. So right here we have additional storage space. You can utilize this as another working pantry if you wanted to do so. Now, just for reference, coming from the primary closet, that's where we had just come from. This is gonna be our full size utility room. Built in cabinetry, again, with the black hardware, oversized washer and dryer. Love the fact that we have our counter space on top. Go ahead and fold the clothes. Additional storage space. Put your fabric softeners, your dryer sheets, anything of that nature. And then of course, if you need to get some stains out, you have, you have the ability to do so with our full size sink. And then you can easily open up these uh, windows. So that way you can go ahead and let some fresh air in. And if you notice as well, going inside of our utility room, we have pocket doors. So if guests are inside of the house, you can go ahead and close that off. So that way you'll be, you'll be good to go. Then continuing along, this is gonna be our full size study. Look at that. So you have your complete built-ins over here. You have our built-in desk again. Look at the amount of storage space that you would have for all your books or some folks that are not book readers. You could utilize that as extra space to go ahead and add some decor to it. You could fit an L-shaped desk inside. If you wanna just have this as a life space, you can certainly do so. But we have our tall ceilings again with our clear story windows open up right here to go to your driveway. Have you seen a study similar to that before? Look at that, we're getting ready for Christmas. <laughs> Love it. But if you can really see, I know sometimes the video doesn't do it complete justice, but you really can see the amount of space that you have inside. Absolutely stunning. And I love the fact that we connect right here to the kitchen. And then, so this would be your mud room. And then also what I wanna make sure to show you is the casita. So essentially you can utilize it as like a mother-in-law suite or a mother-in-law's room if you wanted to do so. But just for reference, that would be the garage. But let's go ahead and take a look at our casita space right here. Now, this is gonna be what we're working with. Now, if you can imagine, that will be closed off right there. So that would be the entire garage, but they have their own wet bar area right here. They have their own little formal space where you can utilize this as a complete living room. And then of course you can add you a nice Murphy bed or something of that nature if you wanted to. But if you see, they do have the access to our nice little courtyard area. You have two access points as well. You can obviously opt if you want to go ahead and build in sliders, you can do so, but they have the, their full size bathroom attached to it as well. Zero threshold again, beautiful tile, shower surround, absolutely stunning. So they can utilize this as their own little privacy area and you know access the kitchen if they wanna do so. The possibilities are endless. And, and like I always mention, even if you don't have the mother-in-law, that's uh, staying with you. You probably have some new friends once you buy this place. So that's one thing to certainly keep in mind, but adequate space, you could fit a full size bed set in here without any problems whatsoever. So that way you would be good to go. Now, I don't know if I open this. Okay, so have another storage closet again, just for reference, you have, uh, you have those uh, water bottles right there. So that just gives you the amount of space that you have. And then right here, I'm gonna have another powder bath. Very cozy in here, I love it. So if you notice the wood flooring extends in here, have you seen any sink as beautiful as this one? I don't, <laughs> I don't know if you have. Beautiful accent wall, of course our oversized mirror with our um, mirror frame and brass lighting fixture. So I'll close this off for you. We'll continue down the hallway. And of course the tall baseboards walk in. So if you can imagine, look at this. You have these beautiful tall 
floor to ceiling glass panes again and this you could utilize this really as anything if you wanted to have this as a secondary study you can do so for the kiddos just another life space i can see most folks adding possibly just you know some um chairs right here for a formal area or really just for decorations quite frankly if you wanted to do so you could do that as well wow love the amount of windows that we have in here especially on a beautiful day like this can you imagine how much light enters inside of the property but let me go ahead and do one more pan so that way you can see the entire house now if you can imagine that's where we come from that long hallway you have the hallway going to your primary bedroom over there Ooh, i don't think you can get much better than this folks all right, last but not least, let's go ahead and take a look at our beautiful backyard. And this is the icing on the cake. If the house didn't do justice for you, I think this backyard may. So we have our wood ceiling on top. Look at our built-in grill, folks. Built-in grill, you got a built-in griddle again. Perfect for hosting, look at this. You can imagine. Opening up your coyote grill. Look at this. Love it. So we have it. The covered backyard patio extends all the way over here. Easily being able to entertain 20, 30, 40 guests. You have your built in fireplace over here. Go ahead and watch NFL Sundays. It's coming up in a few months. Or a PGA tournament. Anything. NASCAR, you name it. But look at that. We love the fact that we have stucco all on the back exterior of the property. The natural stone extends. Look at this. Oh my goodness, our infinity pool. You have a golf putt, putt putt area over here. I don't know if y'all have ever played a putt putt before. Putt putt is really nice. But look at this. Look at this, folks. Can you imagine this being your backyard view every single day? So like I said, they're building some other homes right now. Some folks are living here, not to mention they also have lots that are available. So of course, reach out to the information below so we can find out how we can help you, get you squared away, get you taken care of. But look at this. And if you recall, right over there, that's where we had our access to our primary bedroom. So our primary bedroom right there, you go ahead and sit down for your morning coffee. Continue on along here. Goodness gracious, folks. You got to let me know in the comments what you folks are thinking about this. But man, and look at this additional yard space for the kiddos. Some folks may be worried about that, but there are lots that don't have that slope as much. So if you wanted to partake in that, you can certainly do so. Look at that. That was our primary bedroom, all the window space that you can imagine. Let me go ahead and get down here for you folks. Hopefully I don't slip. Okay, we are, we are good. All right, so let me show the back of the property. It wouldn't be a complete tour if you didn't see the back of the home. But look at that. We have our tile roof on here. That extension as far as our covered backyard patio and our extension over here where our primary is. But other than that folks, that was the lovely Grand Endeavor Homes. All right, Reiki family, that was the beautiful Grand Endeavor Homes right here in Georgetown, Texas. Let me know in the comments what you folks thought about this one. I'd love to hear your feedback. Me, I gotta give it a 10. I think this is the best one we've seen on this channel and I'd love to hear your feedback. If you want more information about this plan or any plan that I showcase for that matter, reach out to the information below so we can find out how we can help you and get you taken care of, no matter if it's Austin, Dallas, San Antonio, Houston, you name it, we got you taken care of. Reach out to the information below. Consider hitting that subscribe button and I'll see you folks on the next property tour.